your question is solve using the quadratic formula give up to two decimals now so they have given you x square minus 10x minus 3 that gives you 0 first we will write the formula what is that that is your x is equal to minus b plus and minus root under b square minus 4ac by 2a now we will find out the value of a b and c you can see our standard form is what our standard form of a quadratic equation is a x square plus b x plus c now your a is what compare it you will get 1 that means coefficient of x square is 1 and b is what you can see minus 10 and c is what you can see minus 3 now substitute this value here we get x is equal to minus b that means minus of minus 10 minus of minus 10 plus and minus root under b square b square is minus 10 whole square minus 4 into a a is 1 and c is minus 3 by 2a 2 into 1 what we will get minus into minus is plus so we will get 10 plus and minus root under again minus 10 square is 100 minus into minus is plus 12 by 2 now so this gives you what it gives you 10 plus and minus root 1 1 2 by 2 1 1 2 by 2 what we will do now we will take out the value of 1 1 2 square root of 1 1 2 what is that we will find out 1 1 2 make the pairs from back side so you can make a pair and this is alone now what happened 1 1 you will get 1 here now add 1 this side same value you will get 2 here and here you will get 1 and 2 12 we, we have pulled this down 12 now if you put 0 here that means what it will become what more than this value if you put 1 only if you put 1 here so that means you have to multiply 1 into 21 is 21 it is greater than that so what we will do we will first put 0 here 0 and here also you will put 0 so you will get 2 0 after that what we have to go we have to put a point here when we used to put point here you will get two zeros here now what is that you can see it will go in five times five times six times it will not go so five times means here you will put five 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 is twenty five zero and 10 here you will get 5 7 1 175 again add 5 here we get 2 1 0 and place 2 zeros again 
So this is the long division method we used to say. Now what we have to put? Maybe uh, seven times. Seven or eight. Yes, we, we can put eight also. Eight. So now it will come as 64, 8 and 16. So they have told up to two decimals. That means 10.58. So now we will write here. We get 10 plus and minus 10.58 by 2. One time we will take plus, another time we will take minus. So first we will take plus 1. So plus value is what? Just add it. 20.58 by 2. 20.58 by 2. That is equal to, we can say now cut it. 10.29 is the first value. Now we will take minus. Minus you can see 10.5 is greater that means what you will get we will get minus 0 0.58 when we sub subtract it by 2 that is equal to minus 0 0.29 so this is the second value we get